this again, so there's no point. Um, just there we go. Yeah, it's not working. So, shit. <laughs> Y'all, I can't mod it, anyone. I'm doing it right, too. All right. There it is. Okay, <clears throat> good deal. How is everyone doing? Um, okay. I'm all right, I guess. <clears throat> oh. <laughs> so, um, how do I start this? Well, first of all, I just wanna say like, that um, I don't I don't want this to be some crazy ass live, okay? Like like immature. You know what I'm talking about? Like I, I don't want any of that. We just be respectful. If you don't like people in the comments, like take it up with them later, and uh, just be respectful to everyone. That's all. Uh, I think everyone has a common ground here, so just think about that. You know. And uh, anyway. Being rude and hateful, it doesn't get, it, it's not going to get a message across. And be patient with me because I'm very nervous. I'm also very upset. So um, I'm also very tired. So just uh, just be patient with me. Does any does anyone want to just sit in the box? Yeah, tap the screen, please. Jeez, I didn't think I would be so nervous. Hello. Can everybody hear me okay? Can you hear me? Beautiful. I'm here. I'm just not going to talk, but I'm here to support you. Love you. Thank you. Thank you. See, that's what women do. <laughs> that's what friends do. Um, <clears throat> so uh, let's just start with, I. I want people, if they want later on after I talk, if people want to share their stories about anything, um, and it doesn't have, it can be about any creator that you might have felt that you've been taken advantage of or, you know, done it in a wrong way. This, there's, this live isn't like a, a hate live. I, I hope that we're all on the same page with that. Okay, <laughs> I'm just really nervous, so. Um, but anyway, I'm not gonna look at the comments. I have, I tried everything that I could with um, Gabby to fix this situation. Um, I even like, I, we took a day, like after um, I had that little live, uh, I we took a day to think about things or whatever and then you know talk the next day and uh, unfortunately that didn't go that didn't go well at all uh, man <laughs> I just so I just have been completely lied to and I there's some accusations against someone that I'm not sure. I mean, no, I don't. I mean, I'm sure I don't believe them. 
so the whole blackmailing situation and the reason that, you know, this is what Gabby is saying and why she did what she did to me and Brandy was because Pinka was the one threatening her and Cam, Cam's safety, Cam's school, and also sending her the message with the, um, the rope. That, and, and that Pinka said if she didn't, if she told Brandy or me about, about this, like if she told Brandy or me that it, who it was that was threatening her, then um, I guess they were going to expose her or Cam. Do I believe Pinka did this? Absolutely not. Um, Pinka should be here. Hold on. Yeah. Um, so I think Pinka is in the live. She probably, um, I don't know if she's going to want to talk. <clears throat> hey, I'm here. Hi, Brandy. I'm going to mute though. <laughs> okay. Okay, good. I'm glad Pinka's here. I'm sorry. Um, so anyway, that's the reason that, uh, I mean, I don't know. I just, <sighs> start from the beginning guys. I don't, I don't even know where to start. That's the thing. I don't know where to start. I'm so frustrated that it's like just coming out. So tell me, like, I, I don't even know where to start. I'm not going back nine months. I, I'm not going back nine months. The falling out is kind of like, the falling out is because of all because of this it doesn't make any sense and then that's why that's why she she said that pinka did all this stuff and that's why she blocked me and brandy not not only you know blocked us on TikTok or whatever but blocked us from her phone i should be using initials on i don't know like i'll get better I don't, it is a cycle. I need, all the, I don't believe that, so if someone is threatening her and Cam like that, or oh God, if someone was threatening them like that, I even told her like, let me know who that is. Like, I swear, I'll take care of it. <laughs> I'll do something about it, right? Even when I was fighting with her, yes. Will you come up, Feisty, and just help me with this? Because I'm fucking. You guys, I'm just pretty. Uh, just please understand, I'm pretty upset right now. Hello. Hi. You're doing okay. Just breathe. Try not to focus nah. too much on the comments well that's why i kind of feel like i need someone to talk to me uh i mean i don't i want to talk about things and you know whatever i just i'm kind of scatterbrained right now i've had a really bad night <laughs> and like all of this is it's just a lot and i i get I'm really it. upset i'm just really upset and i i feel for pinka i mean i don't even i just believe that she didn't do that in my, I just don't think she did that. Yeah, you, she can ask questions. I was going to say, so do you want the comments off? And then yeah. maybe I can try to help guide you with some different questions. <laughs> and yeah, then, I'm so... <laughs> yeah, people that'd be good. just, like, message me their questions, and then that can also pop up on my screen if people want to do that. And then I can ask, like, individual questions, maybe. Yeah, I suck. <laughs> I, I suck at this. 
<laughs> yeah, that, whatever you want to do. Okay, one comment I seen um, come a few yeah. times was they want to know what was your first sign of something being wrong? Well, mm -hmm. like something being wrong uh, <clears throat> in general or I mean I think they're meaning like, like pretending the twins like you know how you said there were things that they did that you didn't agree with yeah so maybe start with talking um, about those well the the well i'm just talking about g um just uh the lies and the kind of manipulation and then seeing little red flags of things just all the same stuff that you guys have seen but not i don't think i saw everything the same way but little lies here and there. And obviously I was never a fool uh, uh, about her. Like I knew that she, I mean, it's clear if you watched her that how her personality was, she's, you know, she's a, a very self-centered. Um, you can't really, you know, expect too much from her, but you should be able to expect the truth. I mean, expect too much from her, like mm -hmm. as a, it's it's an internet thing, you know. Uh, I, uh, what am I trying to say about that? Um, the drama, obviously. I don't know. I don't. I don't have a specific thing because it's been so long. It's been a long time since I've even kind of felt this way, you know. So what was your first feeling that made you want to walk away? Like what caused all of this to come about? You, you know what I mean? This lie about, yeah, this lie about Pinko. Okay. And then that was because when that's, that's her reasoning for do for doing this for, uh, you know, dropping me and Brandy and not even like giving an answer about anything. It's not about unmodding. You know what I mean? It's about like, I, I talked to her, I communicated with her just about every day, you know, not, not like TikTok stuff, like off the app, you know, uh, I, I was always very supportive to her on the good things, you know, and respectful to her. And I know that Brandy was too. But apparently she's being blackmailed. Brandy's being blackmailed or Pinka? No. G. She's being blackmailed uh, <laughs> into into you know blocking us and um, not telling us who's threatening her. Right. We it's didn't just, have any explanation as to why we were blocked from uh, everything. Yeah, not just like everything. <laughs> Uh, it was not the unmodding that I could care less, but like, give me a reason. What was the reason? And then the lives that, the, that what she was doing on the lives. And I, I like, I kept getting messages about uh, that she was saying it was me doing that um, or something about doxing the, the school and, uh, and calling the school. That's the messages I was getting. And then I went back and I, I watched the lives uh, on YouTube. Thank, thank you, Nookie. <laughs> and I, I saw like what people were talking about. I didn't necessarily hear her say Angie, but like Angela, but it was, she was insinuating it. Even I got that insinuating that uh, me or Brandy, you know, but really me, I believe. Uh, the dancing and like, you know, the in your face stuff and like, man, she was talking to me. And she says she wasn't. Like I did something to her. I mean, she made comments about, you know, there, people are just butthurt because they got unmodded and that's not even true. That's not true at all.
I just, I, I, it's so ridiculous. Mm -hmm. I don't even know. Okay. okay. Okay, maybe I will need to turn the comments back on. No one's like messaged me any questions or anything, so I'll try to okay. keep an eye on the chat. You just don't look at it. Don't worry about the chat. Just set your phone down and just talk. Okay. Ugh. Yeah. I wish Pinka would get in a box because I know I she. I don't know how I. You guys, I promise you that as her friend that I I did try to talk to her about things. A lot she has good good mods that that do try to talk to her about things we, we don't agree with or give her good advice. Like we're always so good to her, you know? And um can't even get common decency, you know? not <sighs> did she talk about any of the scams to you what's the what scams that she pulls <clears throat> and then someone asked what were the lies if pinka if you're in here and if you're willing to come up i feel like that would be a good start because a lot of this is stemmed from the start of that is what it, it sounds is, like yeah and then so pinka can start telling her story and after that go from there yeah i mean there's a lot of stuff guys like oh pinka just said she's driving right now oh so I don't know, like, uh, with the GoFundMe, is that would be like if you, so I don't know that, did they ever collect any money, you know? I mean, I, you guys are asking about the Coco thing. Uh, as far as I know, and what she had told me, she all, it was all the same stuff she told you guys about, and everyone about, you know, getting the dog trained and all that. But then one day it was just not going to happen anymore. Uh, so, like, that's all. It's just the same thing. I, I don't know. I don't see a scam there because I, I think you would have to collect money for that. And I don't think those GoFundMes um, ever did collect or they ever got money for that. Someone messaged me and asked, do you think that Gabby is using the blackmail as an excuse? Well, <clears throat> it would really it would help if I was like able to talk to Pinka about that. I don't know. The blackmail stuff is insane to me. Like I, I, the whole thing, none of it makes sense. And, uh, I just didn't, I didn't let her gaslight me into believing that, you know, no way. It doesn't make any sense. And if it's true, <laughs> well then I would really like to talk to Pinka, right? Anyway, either way, I don't believe it though. I just don't believe it. And then like making it seem like she's scared like you guys have seen that on live right i'm not the only you know like fearing for her kid i this is insane you guys insane if you don't know about the blackmail then you then you must not have been watching the past couple of days i guess i'm just blown away and like you know what is super disappointing that she has and i told her this myself I, I told her this the things that i'm saying now i on this live right now i said to her last night that i'm so disappointed that she proved everyone right about her because i believe i like believed in her for a long time Um, yeah, I guess she, so I guess she filed a police report against Pinka then. She t that's what she told me. So.
Do you know what has Gabby or G so scared? Is um, like, are you yeah, aware yeah. of? Can you tell yeah. us what that is? That's the big question I'm getting: is what is she so scared of? And because they can tell that um, you're nervous, you're anxious, all of that right well, now. I I am. I just don't want to say you know when you're upset and stuff and you're talk, you know, I just don't want to say things that I'll regret or that are out of anger, you know? So I'm just, I'm trying to be careful. It's, I'm nervous, but, um, but I will talk and I will get it out. I just, you know, I don't like, I don't want to hurt anyone, you know, but damn, when something isn't right, it isn't right. And uh, those are s serious uh, allegations against someone, right? To say someone's threatening these things. People just want know. you to tell your truth. I am. Hold on. Just breathe. Do you have some water by you? Maybe get a drink of water, that might help. I am, I am. And someone said, what allegations are you speaking of? To have, file a police report against your mod for threatening, um, apparently threatening the safety of you and your child and the school, and then also sending you, the, remember that whole, uh, the, the rope thing that she supposedly got sent? someone telling her to unalive herself. She said that that was Pinka. Yeah. I don't know. So that Pinka sent, sent her that. Can you hear me? When I was reading in the text earlier, it sounded like Pinka said she's the one that got the rope text. Like someone know, sent it to Pinka. So if, hopefully she can she get said, on soon. No, she said Pinka sent it to her. Okay, so I want to say one thing about Angela, guys. I reached out to Angela months ago because I have not been a Gabby supporter for a long time, asking her <laughs> what in the world is she thinking being a mod for her. And Angela is the most amazing person. Like, we all give people second and third and fourth and fifth chances but i look up to angela so much because she's behind the scenes trying to help gabby be a better mom trying to help her do different things she's not in the box every day trying to talk to gabby but she is literally trying to help her become a better person and a better mom and she is so hurt by this so just be a little bit just be patient with her Oh, no. thank you. Thank you. I'm, I don't, I'm just, uh, I'm also going through a hard time, guys. Like I'm, uh, you know, I, I'll tell you something that I did last night. I, I stayed up way too long and I was watching videos and looking at photos of my son and like thinking about the type of people that, the type of people I want to surround myself and the things that I want to be involved in, you know, and this stuff is insane. And I, I don't know, the real life is like people, people are going through things. And uh, you don't know what they're going through. And I, uh, I just could never treat people like that. I just couldn't, I couldn't even tell lies like that, you know, to hundreds of people. Do you feel like the friendship was one-sided, like you gave your all and got nothing in return? Oh, I didn't give, I mean, I didn't give my all, come on. <laughs> I was a good friend to her, but I always knew, like I said before, I always knew. I mean, she was, she was all right to me, yeah. I mean, she wasn't, uh, I mean, I wouldn't allow her to like, you know, treat me horribly or anything like that, but it's just what it was. It's like an internet friendship. You know what I mean? Um, I didn't expect much from her. I've never really seen her like be friends with anyone too long, you know? Yeah. 
heart. I'll let somebody else up. God, I'm scared. Don't be scared. It's okay. Um, someone, they keep on asking about the autism. <clears throat> I, just, I just don't know. So, I don't know. Um, no. I did. Okay, so I saw um, just the documents from like the ABA, uh, the, the, what was it, like an evaluation thing? Um, but I did, I've never seen a diagnosis. I've, I've um, advised her when she got to Florida that she should take him to, you know, find a, a doctor and then take him to, or so that she could get a referral to actually get the diagnosis from the right doctor, you know, and get an updated diagnosis. But I've never seen, um, he, it, I saw uh, the sensory stuff, sensory issues, stuff with his hands, all the same stuff you guys saw, really, I think, I think you guys saw that paper. Um, people, too, want to know if, like, are you scared to talk? Did Gabby, like, threaten you? Or oh no, I'm laugh? not scared of Ga I'm not scared of Gabby. Like I don't, I'm not scared of Gabby in that way. Um, I uh, I just don't myself want to say something that I'm going to regret. Like I don't, I don't want to do say things that I don't that I'm not I don't feel good about. So I'm just trying to be really careful. And I'm not like I'm not like I don't I like to just watch TikTok. <laughs> like I don't. This is, it's hard for someone who hasn't done this before and, and people, you know, they make it hard. Yeah. Cheesy. Cheesy. I don't know if she knows that she's up here. Okay. <laughs> I mean, if you guys, if you don't feel like you're getting what you want, then I don't know. Hello? Okay. okay. I think people, they... I'm just... What? Go ahead. The messages that I'm getting is people just want you to tell your truth instead of feeling like you're walking on eggshells because after this, you know G is going to be yeah. talking about you. And I if, do. If you stay quiet and you don't say your truth, then it's going to be turned around on you that you had nothing and set this up well, for nothing. I mean, I think I, you know, I told you, you guys what I'm, what I'm upset about, why I'm, you know, done. And like, I, I just want people to know that like, that's, that's what she's saying, that it's, that Pinka's doing that, how ridiculous that is and making all these people feel bad for her. And like, she's being <laughs> stalked and threatened by Pinka. Jesus. So you guys already knew that. Okay, well, shoot, sorry. Yeah, Brand Brandon can talk if she'd like. I don't know. I'm not going back, guys. I no. I'm just so fed up. That's another thing. I'm just fed up. Like the whole thing is negative. All the hate, all the lies, all the like trying to help, trying to help someone. Like have really believing in somebody that just won't do anything. Won't do anything. 
Do you think that she is lying about the threats to the school and everything for a yeah. money boy? I don't. I don't know about for. Well, I mean, how is that a money grab? I mean, if. Well, I guess if people are feeling bad for you and throwing money at you, no, I don't know. I don't understand it. I don't understand why she said that or is doing that. Okay, so maybe we can reel this in a little bit. Um, yeah. So everybody is a little frustrated because there was a huge post all over Reddit saying that, you know, someone was going to come out. They were one of her mods, and it was the same time that you went live mm -hmm. the other day. Right. Were you the one that made that post? No, I'm actually banned from the subreddit. Okay. So then next, um, <laughs> I guess people are a little frustrated because they're like, you know, um, all of this is over. You feeling like you guys aren't friends? All of it is over the, the well, I mean, no. The obviously getting treated like that sucked, right? Because I you never have ever treated her like that or anything. But really, the reasoning and the lies, like the lies that she's telling everybody, this whole thing, the reasoning is a lie that she that she even did any any of that. Any of what I, I, I like uh, the blocking, the not answering, the going on live, saying all the stuff that she said. Like there, there's a lot to that. Okay. And then that's serious to accuse Pinka of that. And yeah, then I don't, di and I don't know much about to say Pinka. you filed a that so, was her mod and her friend. Unless Pink is here, I don't think it's great to talk about someone like that. I don't know well, anything about that. But okay. I just yeah. what I'm okay. I'm sorry if you're like frustrated. No, not you. But I guess what people are frustrated about is because it just feels like the other day you had a lot like that you wanted to get off your chest. I do. Yeah. And then, I do. And then like yesterday there's been like comments that I guess Gabby said something about how she talked to you. Yeah, I did. I, I, at the beginning of the live, I had talked about how I tried to give it some time. Um, I t like told her to take a day and think about this stuff. Like, you know, <laughs> and then talk to you talk to her later because she was off the rails like it it was nuts I wasn't getting any kind of answer so yeah i did talk to her do you like you said you had a lot of stuff to get off your chest did you yeah. like write those things down do you have well, like a list no. is it, <clears throat> like this is more than well, just you not being her is, friend no, it is, there is more to that, but I'm going to be honest, like I, after, I don't know, just after having time to think and, and think things through, there's just like some things I don't feel comfortable talking about, like on a live, you know, to people that, well, that there's just some things I don't feel comfortable saying, and I hope that you can, you can respect that. Well, and you do, though, you keep on saying the, um, that the lies that she says, no. give us yeah. the lie. What are the lies? Yeah. There's, there's a lot, there's a lot. So I, you know, a lot of people are asking and I mean, it's, it's, it needs to be addressed. Obviously yeah. you saw last night where mm -hmm. she shut Danny down. Obviously there's yeah. something that she doesn't want out because when mm -hmm. it came out that you were going to go live, um, mm -hmm. she freaked out about it. That whole entire day she was freaking out about it. What right. is that? What is that? I guess, okay, what she, what she, <laughs> I can't do it, guys. So she said Pinka has stuff to expose her um, about Cam. I just, I don't know, guys. Ask, 
Uh, I don't know what to say. <laughs> so that yeah. is clearly what has her so scared. So okay. Pinta, pull your damn car yeah. over and come and fucking give the people what they want. So do you have information about her that 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 she's afraid of? Is that why she wants to talk to you and, and make it so you're afraid or whatever reason? Well, I'm sure, well, yeah, I mean, you know, we were, we were friends. We talked about a lot of personal stuff. I'm sorry, guys, the comments are going crazy. So if you tag me, I'll try to yeah. see them. I'm trying to help as much as I can. I was um, gonna say, I think, <laughs> What was Just that? One I, you guys, yeah. there's so, you know, like you guys want me to say stuff that you already know. Well, then like I, I mean, just confirm it. About That's that. The I think a lot of oh. people would like some confirmation. They would like some like truth in all of this. Yeah, I do um, understand that. Uh, because, you know, I mean, we can see it for so many months and, and years. Yeah. I'm, I'm newer to this, but we can see it happen. But then it's, it's, I mean, you have to understand everyone else's side because it's, it's rather frustrating when, you know, yeah. there's this big Reddit post, you know, we're going to expose her and then you come. Yeah, I didn't do that. I know. I, I'm just saying, <laughs> and it was at the same time. And then right. everyone is like, you went live and you were rather gung ho about like talking about things. And then it just like got shut down. So one big thing is, is C is mm -hmm. the CPS case honest? Like, is that an ongoing event investigation? No, it's closed. Okay. Or was it? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Gabby said she has receipts. If you spoke on what is going on, does she have like garbage on you? I don't know. I mean, well, I don't know what. I don't have like uh, anything that she could show that I would be um, embarrassed of or would have to explain or anything. So, okay. Um, yeah. Another thing was uh, the diagnosis. Did you ever see proof of him being diagnosed? No, I told you. I said okay. that. Okay. Um, I just saw the 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 stuff from uh, February twenty three. Um, just the the stuff that you guys saw that she showed up like everybody. So but I've never seen anything else. Okay, and then um, they're talking about lies. Like everybody wants to know some of these lies. I mean, I mean, I listen. <laughs> Okay, while you're thinking no. of that, maybe you can mm -hmm. answer, has anyone given her, including you, money for, um, like, sugar or her pills? Um, no, I have not. Do you know any of her mods that have? For, like, paying for a prescription? Or anything else? Yeah. 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 Yeah, okay. they've. I, I mean, I know of one time that they've helped out that they paid for it, but it. I mean, it was a legit prescription, so. So I don't like bringing children into it, um, but I will say that a couple of people have said this, and if if you guys have known that um, the child has been in danger, it it, and you're not talking about it or you're not going yeah. to authorities. Mm -hmm. um it it really needs to like be dealt with okay well i um like if, are you talking about this recent situation about the threats and stuff or are you i think they're talking about in yeah. general um, oh, in general he's yeah. really in school the fact that he has mm. been they've been in um florida for how long and he doesn't even yeah. have a pediatrician so yeah, all of those things um, protecting. I, I mean, I every time I talk to her, just about every time I say, if you just kept Cam off, gosh, if you just kept C off, and protect him, protect your family. You know, I, I said that all the time. <laughs> I um, I just said earlier that I would I would talk to her about getting 
him uh, properly, you know, like a new di diagnosis. I, I think because you guys don't see it, you don't think that it happened, or you, you think that no one ever has talked to her about these things. And and none of us are saying that you probably haven't talked to her. No. I mean, I'm sure that's no, I have. Um, out is because you do try to talk, and then she gets angry. Yeah. And, I mean, look at what no, happened no. last night. Um, no, do she, you do you yeah. know if she's getting disability for the kid? Yeah, I'm not. I'm not going to answer that. That's a. Yeah, no, I'm not answering that. <laughs> Okay. Um, okay. Okay. So, Pinka, if you're still in here, does that mean you're the one who made the Reddit post? Because if you made the Reddit post, then you need to come up here and explain your story, because that's where all of this is coming from. I don't. I. I don't think she made that post. Someone made that post, whether it was yeah, the truth or did. not, and it's quite convenient that it was done the same exact day that you had said that you were going to talk about it, and then sh and then Gabby started freaking out. Yeah, I. It was funny because I was actually talking to uh, Beautiful Disaster on the phone when that, I guess that post got posted in, on Reddit, and she read it to me, and I was like laughing because I was like, that sounds like me, but I'm I'm banned. And I can't comment yeah. on there. <laughs> I've been banned for a while. And I, I wouldn't, I'm not going to do that. I just did what I did. I, I went live and I, I thought about it. Um, you know, I just, I wouldn't, I wouldn't write that on Reddit. I don't, I really don't. What makes people think it was Pinka, though? It really could have been anybody. I, I, I personally don't know. Um, I know that, that people are talking about um, collecting benefits, um, but she did say mm -hmm. that she's not going to talk about that. Yeah. Um, do you want to go back to the lies? I mean, I'm, I'm just saying, like, with the lies, it's all the same stuff that you guys know. Are they? I mean, it's all the same stuff that you guys have figured out what you think that the, the vet stuff all the it's not, I don't have anything new to tell you besides unless you ask me specifically I don't have anything new to tell you besides um, this important thing that just happened that I'm like extremely upset about uh, someone being accused of these things and I I asked for proof of that, you know. I I feel like it's a big deal to say those things and to be acting that like that on live and lying to everyone. Like it's just, this is just another lie about and then about your child. And the police Is there any, are there any lies that she actually like confessed to you and admitted to you? Um, no, not that I can think of. No, just stuck it out. <laughs> Guys, I'm, I'm trying really hard. So, um, and whoever sent me gifts, thank you. I didn't see those. I mean, I. I wanted other people to get up here. I just wanted to talk about one yeah. thing. I wanted other people to get up here and talk. I'm not. I never said like I there. I never said that I that this was some like. You guys have to understand that I have a conscience and I, I have to live with myself. And like I, myself, my morals, like I, I was already involved. Like even on the outside, even you know through this stupid app i feel like i was involved with a bunch of you know mm -hmm. behavior that i don't agree with and i'm like okay. i just i don't want to be so here's the i don't want to stoop to that level you have to understand everybody else's side because i do they have tried for years to get people to see the scam to see the lies to right. see that that they are essentially using people for money for the government. I mean, it's it's mm -hmm. it's a horrible um, cycle. Does Mimi well, pay Gabby, all, really quickly? Does Mimi Gabby, pay all their bills? No, I, I why, you guys think I know who? I'm just like, asking who pays questions. Gabby's bill. I will tell you this, and I will say this that um, 
that girl doesn't need anybody's money. Yeah, I'm I'm pretty okay. sure. Um, so so she I doesn't think need anybody's the money. The reason people get frustrated is because they have been trying to get the child help, real help, and and you know when she goes around and flaunts that she's doing all this and making all this money and all these lies right. and and you're protecting her right so essentially for the last however long you've been a mod you've essentially been protecting her how have i I'm, how have i been I'm not, I'm her not, about that i'm not trying to like attack you just just hear me no out i'm time. asking generally because, like, you, because when people and i and i get it because you're a mod but because right. what happens is you protect her by keeping her secrets by blocking mm -hmm. people who try to speak the truth. Um, and I know that that's what they ask you to do, but that's what mm -hmm. happens, right? You yeah. protect them in all of this dishonesty <sighs> and all of this, you know, deceit, right? And then what happens is when you walk away, you get flooded with all of these people who want to know the truth because yeah. you have protected her um, for for however long you were a mod. And, well, and I, I know that you say that you don't want to be involved, but because you went live the other day, yeah, um, that's 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 kind of what happened, right? I I understand what you're saying, but I I. Where I was coming from was, um, I don't feel like I was protecting all her secrets and um, like I, t I talked to her a lot about telling the truth. I really talked to her off. I, I muted and I blocked a lot of hate and um, I, if I blocked people just trying to actually tell the truth, that's why I'm like, you can talk now, you know, I, I owe you that, whatever. But it, there was a lot of hate, you guys, and a lot of people. But and it's it, justified. It was overwhelming. You, you got to yeah. understand that, well, some, that that's justified. Some, I don't think so. I don't, don't believe that. that it's justified that, that because no. she, she doesn't, no. she enables um, her her sister her sister enables her her mother enables both of them um she claims that she's a single mother when she's obviously not a single mother um, right. i get what you're saying the frustration the the wanting to say like you're lying or tell you know all those things that people want to say or, or do say it it's it, that's not what i'm talking about i'm just i'm talking about hate like the things that I, the things that I see, the comments the that are horrible. I'm not talking about that. If you, yeah, that's what I, that's what I'm talking about. The disgusting stuff, you know, like. So a lot of people hmm. are are wondering how. Obviously, you saw what happened last night, right? Between what, okay, so what Abby I, and Danny and yeah. On YouTube, I saw. What are your um, feelings I, about that? I'm pretty upset about that because, um, and you know, I don't. I'm not talking to her anymore, so you know, I don't. I don't have to say anything. Like um, him having his shirt off and the camera being right on him. Um, I believe that. I believe that she had every right to say something, and me and her do not get along because. She, she just doesn't like me, and she said some things about me. But uh, and I agree with her. And then the whole—if that's what happened—if she called and and got her in trouble, and then got her basically could get her kicked out. Like she's on a roll, you know. <laughs> yeah, she's really on a roll. That's. But then I feel I think, bad. I feel I bad. The in problem a problem is, is that. I mean, I'm not. I'm not saying that that Danny's a, a good person, but to to literally call her mommy and cry to mommy to tell yeah. Danny to shut up, and then yeah. um, Danny is now not able to talk. It almost feels like that's kind of what happened with you. Is that you? I mean, you were you were talking about wanting to have this huge conversation with them or about her and then you had a conversation with her and then now 
the conversation was hor that's what I got out of the conversation was that big lie about or that's what, the big thing about Pinka that's what I got that's so it not a yeah not a I'm not you guys like I'm she's not she doesn't like have I'm not intimidated by her I'm not not saying things because of even what she'll say I'm, I'm saying it because certain things I'm not talking about because I don't want to and I don't feel good about it and you have I, a couple what people who are asking yeah. to come in the box um you should have oat milk yeah, I don't know um can you let oat milk up um and then there was someone else and I didn't want to interrupt not you in <clears throat> they're not in there oatmeal isn't in there uh, it says eight people are waiting for the box, apparently. I know, I got it. I'm looking at it. I'm looking at it. So the big thing that so, yeah, they're not really in there. everyone needs to figure out is who the fuck made the Reddit post then, because Pinka yeah. said it wasn't her, and Pinka said that mm -hmm. she doesn't want to do this. Right, and I don't blame uh, her. I don't blame her. <laughs> One bit. Who, who hyped it up on Reddit? I don't know. I see. I don't want you to think that I, I was coming up to try to like, um, like I was, I was making lunch and dealing with my kiddos. So I was kind of glad that you did. I was a little busy. Okay. You guys think that I, I, st I stood up for C. I, I mean, I don't know what else people think I could do besides saying and pointing out a lot of the things that the same things that you think or the, the same things that you guys are worried about. Like, and I'm not the only one that does that because I mean, we cared about Gabby, you know, and when you're a friend to someone, you're going to tell them when, when things are, when they're doing wrong. I mean, that's what a real friend does, even if it's, you know, not an in-person friend, you know, I mean, can you let waffles in? Tried. I'm telling you, so many of us have tried. I want, um, I've been hacked as asking for a box as well. Oh, okay. I just tried to um, get the Hello. apples up. Hi. Yes. I just have a quick question to ask before I drop down. Okay, so the other day, you had us wait until Sunday, right, to do this. Now, the problem is, is that you wouldn't let anybody else go live because it was your story. Correct. I, I understand that. Hold on, baby. Nobody's on the phone. And then my thing is, is at this point, I feel like you're still protecting her because okay. to me if i feel like there was something you know that i had to speak on like if i said if i seen you know child abuse or something like that right i'm gonna speak on it if i see something hear something i'm going yeah. to speak on it and i feel right. as if though you got everybody's head hyped up and then you kind of did this to where like now you don't want to speak on anything because you feel like you feel like basically you're, I, I feel like you're scared of saying whatever because, you know, of whatever reasons. Okay. But I just feel as though this live is very pointless if you're not going to tell okay. us the tea that was posted all over Reddit and everybody was excited for it. I don't know who posted it, but I'm just saying mm -hmm. that if you're not going to actually tell us the lies, please stop saying that about the lies because you're not okay. going into details about it. It's kind of very confusing. So that's all I'm going to say, and I'm going to drop down um, because my child is trying to say hi. But uh, And that's the thing. I, I think what me and a lot of people, and I've been hacked, we're all confused about is it's obvious that Gabby doesn't give a shit about you. Yeah. So I kind of don't understand, and I don't think a lot of understand why you have, if you're trying to protect her, why you have this background, why... Um, well, you, when you have 970 people in here trying to support you, right? why are you not speaking out? Well, I think you're only, so I, what I'm getting here is that, you know, you just only want to support me if I, if I tell you what you want to hear. Um, I'm not responsible for whoever made that post on Reddit, guys. I, I'm not responsible for that. And I'm also... 
how aren't you responsible if I, I did, told did somebody I didn't that make you were that going post. Live, but you were you told somebody that you were going live, correct? So then they posted on Reddit to get all of our hopes no. up. Technically, you no. are responsible for that. Yes, you. No, you've been I didn't. Saying this for two days. You had that live where we were trying oh, to God. help you get boxes, and yeah. you had so that much to that, say. That, but now I didn't tell anyone I was going live. You I did. did. Yes, going. you there did. Were 400 people in there. I was, I, I was one of the people that were telling you that you have to go live for three yep, days for 30 days. plus minutes. No, so what I'm saying is when I went live the first time, I didn't tell anyone. Yes, you I did. I didn't tell anyone. Yeah, I'm telling How you did, that you had to have been because if not, it wouldn't have been posted on Reddit. The, How did we all I know didn't about make it? that post? Well, we all oh knew about God. it. So I'm, we all I'm knew that there was a live going on. So honestly, at this point, this live is very <laughs> pointless. And the fact that you're going to sit here and say, well, I don't feel comfortable saying something. Okay. Ugh, thanks. Can you add humane beans? Okay, I, I do have one question really quickly. Um, okay. So I'm, I'm not I'm not responsible for that post. I didn't make that post. I'm banned from the Reddit page. I've been banned for a long time. They ban your IP, okay? So I, I I'm not gonna this is ridiculous. Okay. Did you and G apologize to each other last night? Like is that she why she, she she no she apologized to me on the phone and then she made that bullshit video. Cause it does Which it took no like accountability. It seems well, like you're sort of. holding back on so much. I, and I'm not, I'm not denying that. I'm not denying that. I understand. There are things that I have thought things over and I don't, I myself, I don't feel comfortable talking about that. And if, if that's all you guys want, then I, you can leave. Like it's not, I wanted to talk about something else. I wanted to hear from people too. I got out what I wanted to say. And um, apparently that's not good enough. I mean, I, I'm not sure what else you guys want. Angela, can you hear me? I'm not, yeah, like. <laughs> Add humane beans. Okay. Because I can't. Oh, you, all right, here. What happened? Uh, press accept. Can you, and it, it didn't, now they're gone. Can you request again? Yeah, they're not in there. I tried to accept them, but it uh, didn't let them up. Okay. Hello. Hi. Hi. Um, would you like me to mute or to speak? You can speak. I'm sorry that if you were having to wait a while, this is hard. Well, I just know that two days ago, all that happened. Mm -hmm. And I know that you were around for it. And I know that that helped fuel this live. And I was so excited oh. to come and help be a voice of reason against Gabrielle. Yeah. And I want to know why this has turned like a full, full 360. Like, why are we I, not talking about like I, what we said we're going to talk about? I feel, un I feel uncomfortable. And I, I was kind of just hoping, too, that more people will talk um Angela and I can I you, don't know I Angela. just feel uncomfortable Angela I sent you a direct message when you asked me to and you yeah. didn't respond yeah. I I haven't seen a message from but, you but just hold on you said that you were going to help us out you were going to be yeah. a voice of reason from the inside okay yeah. So many people are here supporting your struggle, how you were gaslit, how you were manipulated, right? Yeah. Why the fuck has this turned into not exposing what needs to be exposed? Why the fuck 
are you asking people to come up and speak for you when you are on the inside, girl? You know it. It shouldn't be us. We're hurt. We're hurt more than you. I know that you're hurt and I know that you've lost a lot and I know that she manipulated you. So why the fuck are you okay, sticking so up for her? You're saying why? that I, that you're hurt more than me. Like, I don't, I don't understand no, about that's... what you don't get about giving you like a box to talk about. I even said any creator. Like, Angela, that is not what guys, I said. You guys have kind of turned. I don't that know. Is I feel like you turned a lot. I said. You said you have the box. If you if you have something to say, say anything you need to say. Okay? I'm saying that you, you need to speak saying. out. You need to speak out. You were a mom. Just, you were told yeah. things that we were not told. You were hurt in ways that we were not hurt, but we were hurt in the same way. So why yeah. the fuck and, aren't you speaking out? Well, I feel like I feel like I am speaking out. I'm not You're sure. You're not. What. You're asking people to do it for you. Well, and whenever like I would ask you a question, you would just kind of give a roundabout answer. And so I just kind of quit asking you questions. You say that you understand how we were hurt when she threatened to unalive herself. And it I, was a I, joke. I do. I do. Then why the fuck aren't you standing up for the people that that happened to? Why are you asking them to speak? It's not our responsibility. You were a mod for her. You blocked me because I spoke the truth, Angela. So yeah. I'm asking you, why is it our responsibility? Well, that's kind of why I'm like, I, I wanted to open boxes uh, because I, you guys. I, you wanted I to do this live. People too. You wanted to do this live. You made us wait for three days. You asked us to speak. Why the fuck yeah. aren't you? How do you think that? How do you think that I'm not speaking? Do you, you have no idea what I said to that girl last night about let how, Clara how she was hurt? Up. Let Clara up right now, because this is bullshit, and you are not letting people speak. Is Waffles still in here? Can we let Waffles up? No, I just think I think this whole thing's a bad idea. Um, I feel like you guys are just, I understand what you're saying. I'm not, I, I understand what you want from me. I'm sorry that I can't give it to you. It doesn't make me feel good to do that. Um, I talked about, I feel like I talked about enough about the thing that I'm super upset about you guys. I have, I have tried with that girl for months. I have said all the things that you guys want to say or want someone to say in the nicest way to her, you got. I, I am she's a, a whole ass adult okay a whole adult I can't control her nobody can but all, a lot of people have tried to help her and I'm sorry that you think it's a joke she's not being protective anything she does from now on I'm just glad that I don't have like any part of it whatsoever it's just it's just not going well you a question and i'm going to be um very very respectful yeah. um yeah. yeah it's not really a question to be honest hun um it's i feel the fact that you're not telling us stuff is frustrating yeah. because it's like co-signing a um blank check not that we know right. or say that we know what you you co-sign for but by letting someone lie and protecting it it shows um character on youtube about right how you know what i'm saying i'm and i, I don't yeah. want to be mean and put you down or you're going through what you're going through um no, I, I get it um but I, i'm i'm older so i i'm trying to articulate words without using test words because i'm a tester um <laughs> So it's it's frustrating to a lot of people that they yeah. thought they were coming on here and you were just going to expose all this 
And I feel like you feel like if you do, then you're just like everybody else. You were her friend and you're dumping her dirty new yeah. wash on the yard. Yeah. And so yeah. I kind of understand what you're saying, but at the same time, we're talking in circles. And it's yeah. frustrating for a lot of people. So don't, don't take it to heart. A lot of people aren't hating on you. They're hating on Gabby and they want to know. And like, I'll, I'll bring it up. There's a question. Do you guys know when she's online lying to everybody? You know it's and you know it's a lie, and you know it's a lie. And then you see Reddit. An example. Um, we'll we'll use this incident about okay. the pinka and uh, the the danger of her child. Yeah. This, I mean, we knew we know it's a lie, um, but. Everybody thinks that you're coming out because you were blocked over this lie, blah, 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 right. blah, blah. Tell your truth about that. Like, the truth is that it's been coming, whatever, so long. I mean, it doesn't make sense that it just happened to me. This is your final straw. I got dropped as a mod. Well, I mean, it, that's not it, though. You guys keep saying getting dropped as a mod. It, It's a, a lot more than that. You know, like I said... I've been supportive, I've been good to her, respectful, even and when I'm talking to her about, you know, things I don't agree with, trying to give her good advice, all of that stuff, being, a, you know, a, a, as much as a friend as you can be, and then all of this happens, like, I'm I'm upset about it, yeah, I'm upset about the, li the lie, the whole big scheme, the, it was like, it was a huge, it was a huge wake-up call, you know, um, I did not say that, I, I said I was asked, to, I was asked, and after I said, after I let her, let them know that my son passed away, within a few minutes, the group chat of mods was asked to help pay for Gabby's prescription, yes. That's not what I said. Okay. I didn't say I paid for them. Oh. Stop looking at the comments because like, it's frustrating okay. you. Yeah. Um, and, and it's frustrating because they're frustrated too. It, it's a both way cycle. And I don't think anybody's meaning to be mean. Um, they're just frustrated because, like you, they've been lied to. And But unfortunately, yeah. you have the details to know what were lies, and we're still guessing. We're, we're we're pretty sure this was a lie. We're pretty sure, like, you know, I somebody mean, calling Cam's school. It was that a lie. I, 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 don't, I really hope it is. I do, too. I, do, I just don't believe it. I, I don't have any proof that... I don't yeah. have any proof that that didn't happen. So I don't... You okay. know what I mean? I don't believe yeah. it. And that's the thing. All these lies, they're getting... I feel like they're getting worse. Mm -hmm. I just feel like they're getting worse. I don't know. That That's the Reddit review. And, and mine, she's spiraling. And they will yeah. get more extreme. I, I agree 100% um, with you on that. What about, like, okay, I know you said that you didn't feel comfortable asking about the um, disability check. Right. But mm -hmm. my understanding, and this is my personal opinion, mm -hmm. if she doesn't have the diagnosis of autism and all that mm -hmm. um you don't get disability because you're behind on learning or you're yeah if you have um, a so, learning yeah oh, yes ahead. i'm sorry if your child has um a learning disability you can get disability for them at three years old they has it diagnosed that young uh, that's my opinion i'm just I mean, asking questions so uh my son um he had he had a lot of he wasn't um, autistic but he had learning disabilities and uh he was very sick when he was young he had rsv he had a um lack of oxygen to his brain but he just had he the school actually recommended that i apply for that for him and he got that um for a while but and, just, and for those that not for that diagnosis for learning disability okay so but guess, you had it, to have documentation and yes. school mm -hmm. and i'm not i'm not trying to be rude here she doesn't take him to a regular pediatrician and stuff mm -hmm. so i don't know i don't believe it's true I mean, that's don't. my personal opinion yeah yeah um, um that's just me i'm trying to think of, of there's so many lies you're right 
Yeah, <laughs> it's all. It really is overwhelming. I, I just, I, I just want you to know that I, I didn't help her. Like, I guess you guys are gonna just see it the way that you want. I just wish. They, you don't I, know I, me. I just wish you understood that I was like trying to help her in the ways that the concerns that a lot of you guys have. Like I did address those. Oh yeah. I'm okay. Wait, 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 wait. Do you see that because because then the chat they were trying to address those situations with the parenting and stuff and being yeah. blocked and muted and the way she yeah. spoke to people about how dare yeah. you tell me how to you know that is mm -hmm. where the disbelief will come. How can you be in the inner link and be able to say it but people in general can't. They can't be Danny can't tell her that she feels like he needs to have a shirt on um yeah you know what i mean well, I, so that, that makes it yeah. hard to believe that you're doing it behind the scenes okay that's my opinion and i don't speak for masses i no, am speaking I, I mean, from I, for me i can under i can understand that um i understand that completely i'm not proud of myself i've, I've said that i'm embarrassed about a lot of things that you know i'm embarrassed for that's why the picture of the clown is literally, that's what I feel like, you know? Yeah. That's what I feel like. So. And then, do you understand what I mean by co-signing? By you not right. speaking up saying that she's lying, that you're co-signing the bullshit? Right. Right. Okay. I do understand that. Okay. I don't know. That, that's really, I wish I could think quicker on my feet for y'all to ask the questions. Yeah, I um, mean, I can't change your guys' mind about stuff i mean no. i can't make you i can't make you be there for uh for conversations that i had you know with her so i mean you, but you can believe you you can educate us and and you're yeah. not comfortable with it at this point um i wish pinka and all of them would come up here with you yeah, and it's I easier to stand as a group than it is to stand yeah. alone and I wish they would too, but I but I completely understand why they're not. <laughs> Can you, you know? explain to me why not? I I mean, if you guys aren't afraid of them, why why not? I think Pinka. I don't. I can't speak for Pinka. Well, I don't. Uh -huh. I mean, I I tried to talk to her about um, what I was going to talk about. I said she's welcome to have a box, but I understand that she's probably too uncomfortable. You know, and and this is a lot. It, it is a lot. It is a lot, but it's easier She's, if you have people stand with yeah. you than to have to stand alone later. Right. I do. I wish that she would, um, because a lot of this is um, sticking up for, you know, sticking up for her, sticking up for Brandy, sticking up for myself, and and all the other mods who you know <laughs> you're she's going to do that they the people before me were right you know they were right that um she was going to do it to me too and i didn't listen but and i believed her i believed her that mm -hmm. it was like just a whole bunch of hate and like it and, and the hate that was coming in it kind of just pushed me towards her a little bit you know it yeah. made me i felt bad for her i mean i'm a hu i'm human and i am sorry that i'm not giving you guys what you want i'm sorry i uh, um angela i i got invited in here this, it may have been uh, a mistake i don't know oh, okay. to invite me but um i do want to say this um angela is going through the hardest time of her life this year and unless you've been there you don't quite get it and um I can tell you that she's in the deepest grief she'll ever be in. And I think she befriended and tried to do her best by Gabby. And Gabby used that to manipulate her and use her. And I think that we need to show her a lot of grace. She may not be giving you all the answers that you guys are wanting. And that's okay. Because everybody at the end of the day knows of the behavior. They know of the lies. And if she doesn't feel comfortable like totally throwing somebody under the bus, that's okay too. I guarantee you she's probably not sleeping a lot. She's grieving a lot and she's doing the best that she can. And I just think a lot of people need to give her grace that sometimes, you know, she probably poured a lot more into Gabby because she had even more time through her grief. You pour yourself into something just to keep yourself occupied. And I don't want to speak for you, Angela. I just want to kind of people show a little bit of grace because unless you've been there, you don't know how it is. And I, I think it's unfortunate that what should have happened when Angela lost her daughter or her son this year, sorry, 
What should have happened when Angela put up a GoFundMe, I wish I would have known about it. What Gabby should have done is said, oh my gosh, one of their mods just lost their son and they have a GoFundMe. Can you guys help and help promote that? That's what Gabby should have done. Cloudy, right. that's a, a lie. I never had a GoFundMe. Okay, well, you didn't have a GoFundMe. Uh, somebody <laughs> said, said you that. did. Somebody she said did. you did, but regardless, she, she should she have said been. I had a GoFundMe, and I never had one. Well, regardless, she should have been of used yeah. her platform to um, help in some way and not just turn around and use people yeah. once again. If she's going to use somebody when they're at the deepest of their life, she'll use anybody. I said I said those exact same words last night to her. Um, so I don't. I mean, I don't want people to feel like I appreciate everybody's sympathy and stuff. And I probably would be a lot different. I would. I probably would be talk, talking a lot better and maybe in a different mindset. If um, you know, this is my fault. I like really thought I could do this. Um, I did get the things out that I that I wanted to really, and I. Um, I'm just feeling a lot of stuff and I feel like the things that people want me to tell them, it doesn't make me, it makes me feel sick to say those things and and nobody cares. They just don't understand. They just want information and I don't feel good about saying certain things that would, that would, that causing somebody else. I just don't feel good about it. I wish people would just respect that. and. And, and when people see mods, because that's a common theme, when people see mods that are with people that you may not consider her a scammer, but a dry beggar. Yeah. And when she dry begs all the time and you have mods, you're instantly lapped into co-signing that behavior. So and I, that's why people I, are very frustrated yeah. because they get tired I, I, of mods protecting. You become what? a shield for the dry yeah. beggar. No, you're you are right. Um, I have spoke to her about the dry bagging before. I especially said the stuff about the battling, like not to say those things or whatever. I I had a different view on being a mod. Like I didn't think, I didn't think that I was like I'm just a mod. Like I'm not. It doesn't mean I I think this person everything they do is is right. And you know um, I'm just. But it it looks like that, and in some ways in some ways it, it was true and i am sorry about that and uh i don't know and what else to say about that i if you, I if see, you see a lot of now. these ones that do dry bag across on the internet yeah. there's several of them and they they kind of uh the same chats flow through them and this and it's always the same thing with the mods as soon as somebody calls out the scan the dry bag then they start getting blocked and and you know it's the kind of like the same cycle and so if you haven't had a lot of experience with that you're going to be drugged in and you're going to be they're going to look at you just like the dry beggar and i think that you yeah. have a big heart and i think you truly try to help her behind the scenes and guide her and well a lot a lot of people did like so many other people did that i you know th they got the same thing happened to them like um uh, the disrespect, the like, the being lied to, and all of that. It's like I, there's a lot of people that that were hurt, and a lot of people that didn't get to, you know, say say what they wanted to say, or, you know, if you, if you do speak out, you're being a bully. And but in reality, like the things that she's doing, that like she's the bully, she's like the gaslighter and the bully. I think you're coming around to the other side, sweetheart. Oh. That is just, that is the true definition of most people's feelings of her. What you I, just said. I said that last night. I said you can't do the things that you're doing using your followers and your mods, and then get on here and cry about bullying. And I think that's why people get frustrated because they see that she's doing something or bullying or dry begging yeah. and they're trying to get her to recognize it and then she has a small group of people that go oh no you're yeah. not doing that you're doing just fine right. you're so great you're doing just fine you're the best mother you're the best this and then she eats that little piece up and she just keeps on going with it I also, I, and it's confusing me is, is 
you're still kind of protecting her because yeah. and I'm trying to understand it because it doesn't make you feel good. Is is that like the real reason? Like, because you don't yeah. want to be a a bully, a mean person. I feel like some things um, that if the, some things that you guys want me to say to you, I don't think that it's, it it will be productive, and I don't I mm-hmm. don't think. I feel like you guys already know. You really already know a whole lot of stuff. Uh, you're you're right about a but lot of things. But she always like gaslights not, us. She always gaslights right. us and says we don't know. So, like, I, know. I, I know. think if you if you were able to answer, if we were if I if we were able to come up with the exact questions for right. you and answer it, I think it would help. I'm just not that gal. <laughs> I mean, I think the I think the live just didn't go as well. I thought, you know, I thought so I was giving, I was going to talk about what just happened, what I was upset about, and uh, let people know that that kid is not being threatened because I don't believe that he is, you know, and um, the the things I just I did I was talking about a lie, a pretty important lie, and um, I talked to to you guys about the stuff that I have said to her. Um, I, I don't know. I, I, I don't know what else I can do. Like, I don't want to, I don't want to be a hater and, a, and like, I, mean, I say a hater, but like being mean, you know, being hurtful and hateful as like a revenge thing. And that's not right. Yes. This in the, I don't feel good about that. Mod chats, do you guys discuss, like, like a lot of us think, that a lot of this stuff is schemes. It's um, stories that they discuss, they no. come up with. Um, the, the mod chat that I was, I was in a mod chat before my son passed away and then I never kind of got back back into that. And it was, no, it was it was with some really great girls. It wasn't, um, it wasn't like that at all. No, no like scheming or, no. No, those okay. girls wouldn't co-sign that, no. Hey, Angela. <laughs> Yes. This is Chickster. Hey, Hi. not necessarily a question for you, but something I would okay. like to vent. Um, yeah. And if you want to have anything to say on it, I'm, you know, whatever. So I've been watching G for quite some time. Um, yeah. You know, we can go back to Chicago. And, you know, I've been watching the spiraling, spir- spiraling going down. Yeah. But really this weekend, I, that was, this weekend was uncalled for. Um, the things that have been said from, I'm going to say last Wednesday through this weekend, yeah. um, I will say personally, I was affected. Um, mm. I do not agree with anybody even speaking anything on about unaliving um yeah i take i take that personally um i never say anything i'm i'm always a silent watcher i will say hi i've been in gabby's box maybe three times nothing nothing major this is before it all really started i really started see what was going on um i've been trying to take it all in and you know i didn't get to see the live um where gabby was sitting outside and just having a a meltdown i actually got it off of youtube and the more i watched it the more upset i got because nothing nothing is ever her fault i witnessed it again this morning her and a are going at it C is there. This whole show is going on, and it went on for like 10 minutes. And C's little friend is there, too. So you're not only affecting one, now you've got two that are right there witnessing everything that just happened. Yeah. I That should have been shut down. That should have never even happened like that. You should never have to ask your chat for permission or hey you know what i need to go get this should i do that that's your decision you're the adult you don't come to the chat and go well because i didn't do this this is happening it's not the chat's responsibility 
you as an adult make those responsibilities. So if the car didn't have whatever, the warranty, okay, it's a lesson learned. There's nothing you can do about it now. You add it on and it's going to be something ungodly. So what right. we need to do is instead of focusing on what's going to happen, how about we put some money aside so that when this does happen, we have something to go to. Instead of right. spending it on 15 swimming pools and this uh, little hang-up thing that I've never seen him in since it was bought, and then we buy this Jeep. We're buying, we're like buying his love, and I don't agree with that. I'm not saying she's a bad parent. I'm not saying she's a good parent. I'm, I'm not even going to go there. But I don't think we should have to buy everything and then turn around and sell the stuff that he likes. I, uh, so what I'm, I am, I'm concerned too about, I'm concerned about a lot of things. Uh, and definitely when I watch those YouTube videos, I was, uh, I don't know, I, I'm very concerned. And I'm also, you know, very, I'm worried for his safety in general like um that's why i've been i've been asking her to keep him off live you know absolutely absolutely he should not be be on live at any time but he's too young and it doesn't he just it's it's not fair for him the internet is around to stay it's not going anywhere and by exposing him now by the time he's probably 10 years old, he's all over. And, and people are watching from the age of three to the age of 10. And that's well, not fair because he, he's going to he's going to find out about this stuff. Right. I, I've talked to her about that stuff. Um, I, I have pleaded a case about that. Um, other mods have tried to do that, too. So we have spoke out about that. Yeah, it, she it, did. Try, she, she did try for a little. She did do it for a little bit. She agreed to. You know, um, but like I said, you, she's a grown up, you know, I mean, yeah, and, and it, I, I respect her for protecting your child. I 100% respect that. I don't have children. I have nieces and nephews and, you know, I, I, so I have nothing to say on the mothering part. It's not my business. What you do with your children right. is yours. You are the one that has to live with them. Yeah. But. And it's and, and I don't want this conversation to go to see because it, it's not him. No, I don't either. It, it is a hundred percent her and the way she treats people individually. Yeah. yeah, I would love. You don't know how many times I want to hit that multi guest button and just talk, but I know I can't because she's going to shut me down. Yeah. To, because I want to. I want to. She didn't talk want my feelings. Either. She doesn't want to hear it. And the thing that threw me over the edge last night, and then I'll, I'll stop, is when she silenced D. That was 100% ridiculous. You do not go to your mom at 32 years old and tattletale. What those two get in arguments about is between well, those two. You should I, never more, threaten that to your sister. I'm just kind of more concerned about, like, that she would be threatened to be put out on the street. I, that bothered me a lot. Well, because I'll be honest, I think Mimi likes, um, uh, I can't, G, and is just, it, it all started from the 4th of July yeah. when the incident happened with the rocks. Yeah. That was, that was uncalled for. If, if they're sitting right there and, and an individual is throwing rocks, they have a right to say something. What, you know, what if somebody would have got hit in the head or whatever? And it wasn't even like you could pick up the rock and you could put it into the next spot. That's all fine and dandy. But just trying to correct it while it's happening, I mean, I, I, felt, I felt horrible for D. And... You know, I, I feel like D tries to do stuff. The whole, you know, G got sick and D was there and then D ended up catching it, but nobody came to her. So it, it's definitely one-sided. Um, I just hope someday that she'll wake up and it's not too late. Um, that people that have tried to stand beside her well, are going to walk. Afraid, 
I, I am afraid that she's going to kind of hurt somebody or, you know, kind of, you know, use somebody and that they're actually going to come after her because she's very open with where she lives, all everything, you know, yeah. and uh, she doxes I, I herself do worry about that. I, and I've talked to her about that. Yeah, I mean, it does worry me a lot. You know, I, I'm not a perfect person, nor will I ever claim to be. I, I stay silent until it has gotten me to. When it's affected my own personal life, that's bad, because I'm holding something in, and knowing that my wife knows nothing about what is happening on TikTok because she doesn't even watch it. She doesn't care to, and that's fine. Yeah. And, you know, I'm not, I'm not friends with these people. I know that. They're just internet friends. And, you know, there's, there's days that I would be like, man, I wish I could just, you know, meet somebody on the internet just to talk to or whatever, just somebody outside. But after watching all this stuff, not even with just D and G, but just across TikTok itself is disgusting. The amount of beggars that are out there is disgusting. And when you sit, and this, this isn't about D or G, this is about a completely different creator, that her and her husband can sit on there all day long and they can get, they can get thousands of dollars. I've seen it, at least this individual has gotten at least six to $8,000 within the last six months. And I, I'm thinking, what I'm doing something wrong in life. I, I get up, I go to work, I come home, I work from home too. I mean, I, I just, I guess I wasn't raised that way. And right. when you need something, and if it involves money, then you figure yeah, it out. You work for it. You yes, for I was it. never <laughs> given anything, yeah. ever. I, you know, as a child, I worked on the farm with my dad. That taught me growing up that you have to work for something. You don't just get it handed to you. You know, and I, and I don't want anybody to think that, you know, I'm not trying to be mean. I really am not. I no. just want to express myself and my feelings because I know I can't to her. Because, and, why, I, and I hope she's that, listening. I, I really do. It. And this is nothing negative to her whatsoever. Nothing. I'm speaking my mind. Nobody is in my ear. I don't even I don't even have real like go live or anything. No, neither do I. I, I just I get I, I've taken it so long and then this weekend it just really grabbed me and I'm like I can't do it. I can't do it. I will literally watch from the outside. I won't come in to the live anymore. I, I can't. Because I won, I can't watch the comments. Because people well, have got things to say that are correct, and people got things to say that mm, shouldn't be said. But if somebody would just listen, uh, life would be better. But she uh -huh. won't, and so we just have to deal with it. Well, that's why I, want, I wanted to open the boxes to people so they can talk. And, um, you and I appreciate you. you say. Yeah, yeah, I appreciate you bringing me up. And like I said, I, I don't hate either one of them. I just don't agree mm -hmm. with what has has transpired in the last three days right and i think it's only yeah. going to get worse well you know i'm worried about it and i am upset for the way brandy was treated as well like i'm upset about all the people that yeah, have been treated badly Bro. and didn't get to even say anything you know right you don't hear me right yeah and you know we'll um, can, uh, can, Chixer, no don't yes. be rude please we're gonna uh we'll let some other people talk but i appreciate absolutely you absolutely in here and Sorry. Um, i absolutely appreciate you uh okay no worries thank you oh i i appreciate you letting me up angela am i still on the live or no oh shoot you're honey you got to get off here <laughs> That's no good. Does anybody uh, want to speak? Um, yeah, I uh, please have a few do. things I'd like to say, but I also just have a few questions for you, too. You okay. you love to mute and block me in on all of my mm -hmm. accounts and Gabby's lives all the time, and I've only ever spoke the truth, which is 
hilarious that it takes your feelings being hurt for you to want to give people a platform now to say the truth. Um, yeah. I'm just going to take advantage of that and hopes right. that the piece of trash Gabby herself is listening. Um, you do know, I mean, I'm assuming because you won't say, but you say we are on to and we know facts about Gabby like that's nonchalance you know so mm -hmm. why did you want to be friends with someone who clearly didn't change her child's pull up before school I, I don't know that she didn't change her child's <laughs> pull up before school I mean like you guys I'm not there all, all the we time all know, like I right? don't we, we, I mean, chat. No, can no. We we, agree? Well, maybe you guys all know. I didn't even know that that she didn't change her kids. You don't like up. hear I mean, I don't... people say these things, though. <sighs> or like when you're blocking this, you don't like believe us. Mm -hmm. Do you think we're being mean? Well, I did think you were being mean. Yeah. Okay. Why don't yeah. you think we're being mean now? Because you went back and well, watched no. it. No. No, I think that I was wrong. Okay. About some things. I think that there was a lot of hate and there was a lot of mean people. And I think that, but I think I did, I did silence people that were just, there were people that were trying to speak the truth. I, I told you, well, I said that earlier that I, I used to not think that way. I thought, I felt like a lot of it was just all hate. I mean, I, I'm glad that, I'm glad that I, I don't know. I'm glad that I've come around. Regardless, I, I was wrong if I, if I silenced you and you were just trying to get something out. Oh, that's nice okay. Way. I'll keep I mean, coming back and saying it. Right. <laughs> I, mean, lot, I know. <laughs> no big deal. It is I a mean, lot to handle. Yeah, you did choose to do it, and it's something you chose right. to do, you know, for free and, you know, for Absolutely. no purpose, I guess, other than you mm -hmm. were trying to help her in her personal life. But then that also, it just blows my mind that, like, you really thought hundreds of people saying the same exact thing was just being mean, and you didn't want to question her with, hey, did you change his diaper this morning, or what did Pam have for breakfast? I mean, I don't, I, I'm not always around. I, and um, mm -hmm. I was gone for quite a while after my son passed away. I wasn't even, I wasn't even going in there. Um, so I don't feel that those are things that I can, I, I don't, I don't know what you guys are talking about, about not changing his pull up. Okay. I do. I talked to her about potty training him. Of course yeah. I did. We can send you, I'm sure, a, like a link or something to what we're all assuming, <laughs> right? I mean, we're not there. We don't know I, everything. Like, uh, all of, that's what everybody keeps coming at me with. You guys, there are, I, I know I can speak for at least three mods that talk to her, like, and tell her things, at, like, as a friend, that, talk about things and give good advice. And maybe you shouldn't do this, you know? talking from like a, a one woman to another but you cannot force like i don't know what you guys expected to happen i don't expect uh, really I mean, anything I, out of strangers i find it all very interesting and entertaining unfortunately is. i hate the fact that she neglects cam and she thinks neglect is beating or starving or homelessness you know like the dis yeah discipline is not that and right. that's you know that's not the case neglect gabby is not feeding your kid a proper meal neglect gabby is him not having a pediatrician neglect is dirty clothes neglect is a dirty floor neglect is a drunk mom neglect is a absent-minded mom those are forms of neglect, Gabby. Anyone who supports the triplet has zero room to talk. Kristen, I don't okay. I don't care okay. about your opinion. <laughs> Just don't be uh don't be rude to people in the boxes or whatever. I I did I do want to give people time to talk. If that's wrong of me, like if you guys are all gonna hate me because I muted or blocked you, like no, I, I just don't, have to understand I don't that. Hate I just you. Don't, or not wanna or think I'm full of shit or whatever. 
I, or think that I didn't do things or, you know, you guys can think that I co-signed everything. I, I, I promise you that I did not, but I, it was a mistake to stand. It was a mistake to stand by a lot of things, but I wish you knew if I wish you could be in my head. I wish you could understand that for a while, like just for a while, I wanted to like help the girl. I, I did feel bad for her. I tried over and story. over again and it was like, I just repeated myself and then, but I was still good to her because I thought that, you know, someday you might get, get there. Maybe she just does need like a friend or whatever, but it doesn't matter who you are or what you do from what I'm seeing and not just me. It's not just me. I'm not just up here talking about me. I'm talking about two other girls that this, you know, stuff happened to uh, and everybody else. So it doesn't matter what you do for that girl she doesn't care about you and i i feel bad for the people that are going to find out you know like the hard way i don't feel bad for them because well, it's like i kind of do <laughs> well i mean when you sit back and you watch it happen time yeah. and time again you'll unfortunately get to that point as well it's clear that she is a awful human being if you don't love yourself you're not going to love anyone it's very clear she doesn't love Cam with her right. actions and her tone and her crazy look in her eyes, the way she portrays herself on the internet, the way her sexual conversations happen on the internet in front of her children, the way she screams and now probably gave this sweet little neighbor boy trauma from the fight they had this morning. Like, she's just disgusting. Gabby, you're disgusting. I mean, there's things that you that you said that um, that I don't necessarily agree with, and there's things that I've said that you don't agree with, but and that doesn't make us uh, bad people, you know. Right. Um, I I'm glad that you got to speak, and you know, I don't know if she's listening or not, but um, I'm sure I'll, someone I'll, will record it and you know tell her, even if she doesn't hear it. I mean, it's all nice to get off your chest, and other people yeah. agree with most of my statements i'm assuming if not then i don't i don't know i guess you're weird i'm not but the, i'm not what oh no what'd you no, say no, not you i'm just saying to the chat like if they're not agreeing oh. with me then they're just weird i don't know no so i uh i understand everything you're saying um I think if I say like um, that, I, if I say I care about her, everybody thinks like that she, she that she's um, worked her you know way back in or whatever. You guys, th people think a lot of things that aren't true. I don't know like I don't even feel the need to um, to prove that either. You know, I know that I tried to help her. I tried to talk to her about a lot of the things that the concerns, all of that stuff. I did. I thought that was the approach to to. to that was a better approach than like, you know, commenting in a live or whatever. I thought coming from somebody that you kind of have a relationship with or a little uh, like a some kind of friendship for what it is. I don't know what another word for it. You know what I mean? Right. Um, so, so I thought that it would be better coming from someone like that. And and I tell you, like, I just I got tired of repeating myself, you know, like the cycles get old. I just, I'm not the first person that, that had to learn, you know, on their own. I don't think that makes me a bad person. Um, I never harmed anyone in the sense that, like, I never, I never, I never harmed anyone. No, and I hope no one would say that you did, you know. I think a lot of people I are very heated when it comes to Gabby and they're going to be yeah. heated at a mod and an ex mod or right. ex supporter or anyone. They're going to have questions. We all have our own beliefs. We make up theories. Mm -hmm. Reddit is a wonderful place and a nasty know, a place all at the same time. You know, a lot of people like they think that I made that post and I didn't. I, I don't really have any way to prove that. Um, I when I went live the very first time, no one even knew I was going live. You know, I, I there wasn't a. I, I feel like this was a huge mistake. I don't know what I thought. I think I, I was mad and I was upset. And I, there was a message that I kind of I wanted to get across. I thought other people were going to talk about other things, and it, it instead it's like 
I'm taking a lot of heat. That's fine. I knew that was going to happen. You know, I knew that. Um, I, I'm not saying that you're wrong. I'm not saying any of you are wrong about being upset about being muted or blocked, you know? Uh, yeah, or no, having I'm, the concerns. I'm never oh. upset, and I don't think a lot of people, I mean, maybe some older oh, they people are. that have <laughs> parasocial so. relationships are, myself mm. and others, I mean, we can come right back, and we will come right back, we don't, we could right. care less. I'm going to be gone right. with one comment, if I am watching her, and I know that, um, she did just recently unblock a whole bunch of people, because I yeah. was unblocked until I just did get blocked, you know, last night or the night before. Um, also, I, Gabby, if you're listening or if anyone wants to tell her, I think it's disgusting that you want to try to get your sister kicked out. I mean, you're foul. I hope someone somehow can show this to Bobby or Mimi because you're disgusting. And I hope people, I hope someone somehow Danny gets enough courage to actually say the truth and not be afraid right you know you're right um, but I, I want to correct you again a lot of people think that I'm afraid to say certain things and, and that that's not what it is I don't feel good about saying things but anyway waffles is having a live I think that Pinka feels comfortable showing her stuff over there okay and that's probably what you know people want to see